Hey everybody, in this video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to add and use the link reader ChatGPT plugin to understand and synthesize information from various digital resources. So you can use the link reader ChatGPT plugin to read the content of any web page, PDF document, PowerPoint presentation, an image, a word file and more. So this is basically an alternative to the built-in browsing plugin. By the way, I also have a full tutorial on my website on how to use the link reader ChatGPT plugin. So if you want to get more details on how to use the plugin, you can also check out my tutorial on that. And one more thing before I would show you how to use this plugin is if you want to get access to the full database of the currently available chat GPT plugins, you can check out the link in the description below and get access for absolutely free for all chat GPT plugins that are currently available. All right, so how to use the link reader chat GPT plugin. First, if you want to use chat GPT plugins, you have to be a plus subscriber. If you are not, you can click on upgrade to plus on the left here. And if you are a plus subscriber, you have to make sure that chat GPT plugins are enabled in your account. And you can check that by clicking on your account name and selecting settings and selecting beta features and make sure that plugins are enabled here. Then what you have to do is click on new chat, then select GPT-4 because plugins only work with GPT-4. Then select plugins from the list Then click on this plugin icons section. And if the link reader plugin is not installed, you have to click on plugin store here and search for the link reader plugin. So click on all and currently you cannot search for plugin names, but I think this feature will be added soon. But until then, you have to go through the pages and find the link reader plugin. So here you can see currently it's on the 11th page, but this might change in the future. So click on install here and you're good to go. So as you can see, you can use the link reader chat GPT plugin to read the content of all kinds of links so like web page, PDF, PPT, image, Word or other docs. Right, so then all you have to do is basically add your prompts. So in a previous conversation, I asked ChatGPT, and this is a good best practice to follow. Once you have activated the ChatGPT plugin, you can ask ChatGPT how to use a certain plugin, and it has given me a response here. So all we have to do is in natural language, ask ChatGPT to summarize the content of this link and then add the link of that page or that PDF document or Word file or image or PowerPoint presentation. So as an example, I'm going to use this Wikipedia page about affiliate marketing. So all you have to do is copy the URL of the web page then paste it here and add a simple prompt then click execute. And then the link reader plugin, as you can see, using link reader, it has read the URL of this page. As you can see, it has received a 200 status code and it has successfully read the content of this web page. And now ChatGPT4 will give us a summary of this uh, read in content. So as you can see, affiliate marketing is a marketing arrangement where affiliates receive a commission for each visit, sign up, sale they generate for a merchant. So as you can see, the plugin is working and you can also use this to not only read text documents, but you can use it to read PDF documents, PowerPoint presentations and images as well. So as I mentioned, if you want to get the full database of the currently available chat GPT plugins, you can check out the link in the description below. If you want to learn more about this plugin, make sure to check out my article as well. And if you want to learn more about other chat GPT plugins, you can check out my YouTube channel playlist where I show how to use all of the most effective and most useful chat GPT plugins.